Em Zanzi, Yo Yanem. In light of the Casper Newvest, aka the Dribbling Baby Daddy scandal, Sleek Talk also has some few things to say about this. And here's what he had to say. Please watch the following video. A big copyright disclaimer, Mzanzi. Please note that the following video that we are about to play, in Mzanzi does not own any rights to the video or own the video at all. The video is owned by Slick Talk himself and the credits go to him. Good YouTube, this is Slick Talk and I'm back with another video. This Casper in your vest downfall has to be studied. Has to be studied. Casper in your vest baby mama just released a fire Instagram where she exposed him and said Casper in your vest abandoned her when their son was diagnosed with cancer. Diagnosed with cancer and the kid was eight months old. Eight months old. Casper in your vest say it ain't so. Tell me it's not true. I refuse to believe that you abandoned your kid and your baby mother when she, when, when this kid was eight months old and he was diagnosed with cancer. Cancer, that was a, t eight months is a very tender age. Eight months is a very tender age. So for you to be running around the streets when the kid was diagnosed with cancer is crazy to me. It's crazy to me. And the thing is, this year has been one of those years for Casper and Vest that he will never forget. Because things doesn't seem to be going right for this guy. Let's be honest, the music has completely fallen off. The music has completely fallen off. Literally, nobody cares. Literally, nobody cares. I tried to play Casper and Vest music at a family event the other time. And people were saying, turn it off. And I'm like, I just want to play some, you know. Maybe you know, I, was, I was trying to like get the mood right and they were like, no, 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 turn it off. This guy's career has, this year has been one of the worst years for Casper and Yves. And so for you to tell me that you abandoned your kid when he was eight months old and he had cancer and you were running around the streets with Abu Pearl Tusi. And the thing is, when I look back, Casper and Yves kid is, was born in 2020 during lockdown. Eight months down the line, that's like 2021. And 2021, Casper and Yves was Twitter fingers. He had the songs here, Tandana, and he was talking shit. He was talking shit on the gram, on the on the tweets. He was talking shit. He was flashy. That's around the time when he bought that car, three million three million rand car, McLaren. That's around that time. So this man, this whole time, his kid had cancer. He had no business doing what he was doing. But you abandoned your kid and you abandoned your baby mother. And it's hard for me to look at you the same because it just shows the true character who you are. And Casper and Yves, let's be honest, AKA was always carrying your career. AKA was always the source of your career. He was the one holding you down. He was the one keeping you relevant. And ever since AKA has not been around, your career has never been the same. Your career has never been the same. And it will never been the same because nobody cares about the music because the music was never that good. And it's coming to, re coming to the forefront that you were never really a nice guy to begin with. You were never really a nice guy to begin with. And in me, if you be, it surprises me because even Ricky Rick had an issue with you, Casper. Let's be honest. Like, Ricky Rick had an issue with you. Ricky Rick wasn't feeling your energy like that. I remember the first time Ricky Rick reached out to me. It was after a video I made about Casper and your vest. And Ricky Rick said he, I, everything I said in that video was factual. And this was back in 2020. This was back in 2020. Casper and your vest is not the nice guy that he pretends to be. And now he's running around, hiding behind the church, trying to repent for what he did back in the day. But the baby mama just released a fire Instagram showing us, this, showing us that this guy was never the guy that he pretended to be. Oh, Mzanzi, there you have it. What do you guys think about what Slick Talk said? Do you guys think he's going to get round two from Casper your vest? Well, please drop your thoughts down below in the comment section. We would love to hear from you. Until next time, Mzanzi, stay tuned for everything Mzanzi.